Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Noku from Pinewood Gaming and welcome to this Redstone Wonders episode 1. So basically what this series is, is where I'm just going to wonder things in Redstone and in Minecraft and make it and teach you guys how I made it and showcase some of my stuff. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm just clearing my throat. So this is a, well, kind of secret, like I said, I've kind of just rushed this design. But this is a door that works by a jukebox. Now why does that look like a note block? That's really strange. But anyway, moving on, moving swiftly on in fact. This works by some redstone, a inverter, and some sticky pistons. So, what happens if I put the disc in that? <clears throat> My voice is going mental. Bits! What the hell are these doing in here? God damn it! But move! Move! Die! Now I'm gonna save that for later after this video. Wow, more music discs. So yes, yeah, so then if I take the disc out, it closes the door. So, this is basically how it works. I've set up another door over here, and it works by, if jukeboxes are just normal, like they don't have anything in them, they will basically not give out a resident signal. But if a jukebox has a music disc in it, it outputs a resident signal to a comparator. Now, if you're wondering why I've got this repeater here, that's because a comparator can only output one block of redstone. So, anyway... This is how this entire circuit relies. So I'm just going to go above and show you the circuit. Like that. And the circuit will be on screen now in the corner. And I accidentally took a screenshot. Oh well. So anyway. This works by the jukebox is connected to a comparator. Which is then connected to a repeater. Which goes around and hooks into this inverter. So from there, the register signal that is active goes into these two pistons. So the reason I have this design and no other design for powering the pistons is because this seems to work the best. The redstone powers this block as well as the piston above at the same time. So this is quite simple. It's more it's more of a challenge if you're moving on to stuff like this, which is a double piston door, which basically is a pain in the ass to fit into a such a tight space, that's what she said. But anyway I managed to do it and this is the result of it. So if you're wondering why I have an inverter here, that's to keep these pistons extracted. That's just so you know. And to see the circuit in action, if I put a disc in here, you can see the comparator lights up, which outputs the redstone signal to this, which then goes into the repeater, which then makes all this redstone extend, I suppose, which go powers off the inverter, which causes this redstone to deactivate, thus retracting the pistons. So anyway guys, also choose a disc that you like, don't choose the yellow one because that sounds like absolute crap. So anyway guys, it's been Noka here from Pinewood Gaming, don't forget to comment, rate and subscribe for more videos, peace.